from the Beltline to your backyard, while parsnip is popping up all over southern Wisconsin. It burns your skin. It hurts. It really hurts. <laughs> Eight-year-old Caleb Wickowitz was just six years old when he had his run-in with the plant. He says the hardest part for him was getting a good night's sleep. I had to sleep on my back because I usually sleep on my belly. If With all the blisters, I couldn't sleep on it because they would just pop and it really hurt. Caleb's mom, Emily, says it all started two summers ago when she was watching him play in the yard. And with a couple minutes, his arms and his whole chest started breaking out in blisters and burning his skin, and I had no idea what he had gotten into. After seeing the blisters and burns, Emily took Caleb to the hospital, but even doctors were unfamiliar with the effects of the wild weed. They had no idea what it was. I started taking pictures of him and sending him to my husband, and my husband's coworker had said that's wild parsnip, a poisonous weed. According to experts, the plant grows in sunny, open areas, and it's the sap inside the plant that causes skin to blister. So they advise people to simply stay away. You'll get blisters, yeah, it red, red marking and blisters, and oftentimes you'll actually have streaks of red on your skin because that's where the, the sap actually hit your skin. While in bloom during the summer, parsnip is pretty easy to spot, but as it grows more abundant, the Wickwitz family wants those living near the plant to become more aware. Reporting in Sun Prairie, Lauren Winfrey, NBC 15 News.